Welcome to Sentry One. In this video, we will be taking a look at how Top SQL can help you understand what may be going on when you are experiencing performance issues in Azure SQL Database. After ensuring that the Collect Trace events and Collect Statement events are enabled, we can get started by jumping over to our Performance Analysis Dashboard. The first thing that we can see is that there is some unusually high activity in our Resource Usage Chart. So that we can get a better idea of what was running at the time on the database instance, we will highlight a spike in the resource usage chart and select Jump To and then Top SQL. Within Top SQL, we will select the Completed Queries tab. These are queries that exceeded the thresholds set within the Top SQL source settings and were captured using our lightweight tracing technology. The default threshold is a duration greater than five seconds. Here we can see the individual queries that were captured during this time with the runtime parameters that were used. To investigate these queries, we will change to Show Totals mode and sort the total CPU column from highest to lowest CPU usage. We will then expand the grouping with the highest CPU usage and then click on the CPU column. The Top SQL tab is divided up into the following sections. The Statements grid provides a view of the individual queries captured for the selected batch or stored procedure. The plan diagrams on the right provide an at-a-glance view of the query plan for the selected statement. Within this view, you can see which operators are the most expensive in any given plan. For more details or to tune the query, simply click the open button to jump into the Plan Explorer view. This is an integrated and enhanced version of our popular free Plan Explorer tool. Finally, the query history chart shows you the full history for the selected query by CPU, IO, or duration. The different colors represent unique query plans. Simply double click on any point to view the plan for that query execution. This information and more can be seen in our browser-based client within your enterprise and in the cloud. And that's it. Thanks for watching this video on Top SQL, and I hope it helps with performance issues in Azure SQL Database.